And also because I'm starting to like confuse myself with how I keep changing everything. God damn it! Urgh. Oh well. I'm gonna go watch football. I love how like the lives are like stuck um six hours because of a flight delays and that because of the weather and everything. I found that hilarious. So I'd rather have Saskatchewan win because um, for CFL they have like the best fans on the planet. Then again, it's all they have, so that's a why. But it's still pretty cool how they have such good fans. What's the dragon armor do? Eh, just pure armor. I don't want it. Give it to you. And I'll give um, the other one to Crescendo. He loses low bit HP, but he gains like pff, what 60 defense, so it's obviously worth it. Wow. See, look, one defense more, and he's holy crap, he's a lot faster. Yeah, he's actually a lot faster than Jazz. Jazz is like your slowest party member. I didn't realize it was that slow, though. Holy crap. Alright, we want to take the F portal. Okay, so if I would have... Uh, this takes me back to where the L portal would have led me, so in the end... I really don't lose much tracking or basis of where I was originally. Alright, then we're going to take the... Let's see. Okay, almost the soul shard, nice. Just kinda checking off what I've got so far. Got most of what I'm here for, alright, this is um Okay. Go down. Yes, if my commentary oh crap, Audacity lagged, Audacity lagged, do not crash. Okay, good, sorry, just lagged. I was like, oh fuck. My commentary might be a little bit like bad right now, but kind of hard to be like a hundred percent like on the ball right now because I'm causing glancing at my map or glancing at the screen to see where I'm at I thank god that my TV is like beside my computer but oh well I digress this will take us uh, to a straightaway to a teleporter uh, and we're back on basement 9 I like how you can practically color code the floors, except for like seven. Actually, not seven, six. Getting lost already. See, my commentary is making me lost. If this was floor seven, it'd be like a hundred part of like part fifty. Okay, we're finally out of there, man. Oh god, that was that was hell. I want to kill myself. Okay, all we're missing now, after all, is the seven branched. And we're gonna we're gonna be going down because if you keep going straight, I'll take us to another teleporter. But we want to get the soul shard here. This would be soul shard um number five because we can't get number four yet. Yeah, that or number four, and we can't get number three yet. I, f I forgot which soul shard we're up to right now. It's just over here though. <clears throat> and let's open it up. Is it full shard? Alright, I'm just trying to see where we can get the fastest way back. We need to get the seven branch to us too. Okay, there's B. Where's B take us? B takes us to E. Okay, um. Wait, I gotta swear I already got that M, didn't I? Oh uh, shit, I'm lost. Maybe. Nice. He's not equipping is he? Okay, he's not. Okay, never mind. We're, we're, we're good, we're good, we're good. I was just a little bit lost. Sorry, I... Let's see. Oh, okay, so I didn't get this, actually. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna take um, this next upcoming teleporter we haven't taken yet. Oh, thank God. <laughs> got my bearings back. I almost got lost, because with all the teleporters... 
Unless you're really keeping track of where you are location-wise, you're not gonna know where the hell you are. Unless you're, like, you just write, like, which section leads to which section and that. You, you don't really need a map, you probably have to make, like, a little, um, diagram, or a web diagram or something of that. The source, to really find out where you are. Alright. B. We're right beside the teleporter, but we don't want to go there yet. Now that I think about it, the route's actually kind of planned out pretty decently. Sorry, keeping mic muted because dogs are howling at someone walking by. Okay, they're gone. Sorry about that. Just all you really hear is like in the background, because it sounds louder than the game audio I currently hear. So we would definitely pick it up. I know that for sure. All right, if I take a left here, that should take me to my last chest. Then we just backtrack and we're done. If this is an open chest, I'm gonna cry. Okay, thank God. Now we got the seven branched. It's for Reddo. I could have swore it was for uh, someone else. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is his second best sword, but look at that. He gains like 24 attack or so. Very nice. And now we just need to backtrack for a little bit, and we're done this floor. Wasn't that bad. I could just at the same time upload them all as bonus episodes. And again, you'd be wondering why the hell I'm like level cap when I'm fighting the last boss. I'm like, what the hell? Where'd that come from? So I'm debating on getting level cap. Like, it's nowhere near required at all. I just kind of want to, just so I can go. Hey, I'm level cap. On our encore mode, like I would say, grinding's kind of required, but it's also a lot more tedious because stuff's a lot stronger. So being over level doesn't really come into play as much. Alright, instead of. Uh, now we're gonna take advantage of the T intersection and take a right right here. And it'll lead us to the teleporter. Which will take us to floor 10. There's only really um, 12 floors plus the final floor. Or 11 floors plus the final one. And the final one's just a boss that has 4 million HP. So he's hard. Yep, teleporter. I knew it. See guys, I think that may have only took me like what one episode. I'm hoping, maybe, probably, hopefully. Okay, let's see. Oh my god, this one is like T intersecting up the ass just because of all the items we gotta get. Let's see. Wow, we're getting like what eight items on this floor? Holy crap! Well, you know what, guys? If that's the case, I'm going to kind of end off the episode here. So next time on Let's Play Eternal Sonata, we'll uh, progress through the 10th floor and go from there. Because we're just about done. So I'll see you next time, guys. Goodbye.